now. Hi everyone, this video is to assist and support existing NZHL clients as of today, March 26, the first day of New Zealand's four week isolation period. So let's say hi to our resident lending expert, Chris Wong. Chris, no shooting tie today. Looks like you're taking this working from home business seriously. Kia ora everyone. Uh, yep, working from home, uh, but still in the work outfit. <laughs> nice one. Well, let's kick into it. Chris, so is NZHL still open for business? Uh, absolutely. Our network of more than 80 franchise businesses across New Zealand are open. Um, and although, of course, you won't find them in the offices, uh, they're working remotely via email, phone and video conferencing. OK, cool. So it's obviously a really busy time. Um, are clients still able to reach their consultants? And, and what's the best way of, for people to get hold of our consultants? Yeah, it is a busy time um, and also very uncertain. But localised support and personal contact is something at NZHL uh, we pride ourselves on. So the network are telling me that um, email is a very good way to reach out to them and they are responding to clients as a matter of priority. So look, they might not be responding as quickly as normal, but rest assured they will get in contact with you. Um, and in the meantime, uh, I'll share in this video some thinking that may answer some of your questions to get you prepared for when you have that con conversation with your consultant. Cool, thank you. So um, before we get into sort of some of the more financial stuff, um, who, who actually owns NZHL? Yeah, great question. Um, NZHL is a subsidiary of Kiwi Group Holdings. Uh, Kiwi Group Holdings is owned by New Zealand Post, New Zealand Superfund and ACC. So that means NZHL is ultimately owned by the New Zealand government. Great, okay. Well, that's something that not everybody knows, so that's a good fact. Um, now, can you, there's been a lot of talk about this um, with our clients and the media everywhere. Can you talk to us a bit about the government's recently announced uh, mortgage holiday? Sure, yeah, the government recently announced a six month uh, mortgage holiday scheme as part of the, as part of the COVID-19 financial support package. Uh, look, it's really important to note that at the time of filming, that these details uh, or the details of the government back scheme are still to be finalized. So we expect to hear the details from banks in the coming days, and we'll share this with our clients as soon as we are able. Um, the minister, the finance minister, did note at the time of the announcement that people would need to be patient uh, while we confirm details of the application process. So look, my advice to you is that um, if you are facing hardship, don't panic. Get in touch with your local NZHL consultant. There are a number of options, including the mortgage holiday, uh, that may be available to you. Okay, so let's let's talk about some of those options because it feels like a lot of people are kind of thinking mortgage holiday, mortgage holiday, and they may not necessarily need that. And and I'll preface this by saying, of course, and I know you're going to say the same thing. You need to talk to your consultant to work out what's right for your personal situation. Um, but talk us through a couple of other options, Chris. Sure, yeah. So look, even though there is a support package out for the nation and all mortgage holders that are impacted by uh, this horrible situation, um, there are actually a few options and it's really important to get expert advice from your consultant so that they can help you determine what's best suited to you. And look, a few options could include um, reducing your home loan payments to the minimum. Uh, some people at the moment are paying more than what's required, so they could do that. Um, changing your home loan repayments from paying principal and interest to just paying the interest only component. Um, and you can do this for up to six months. Or like the minister alluded to, a loan repayment holiday, which means that the homeowner makes no repayments to the home loan for up to six months. Now, it's really important to know that if you're not making any payments, the interest is still being added to your home loan. So after six months, the loan balance may be larger than it is today. Um, and that's also a really important point because at the end of six months, because the loan balance is higher, the repayments at that time may be higher than your current repayments. So that's really important to know. Yeah, agree. And, and talking to a, a lot of the network of business owners that NZHL has, they, you know, they, they're reiterating this to clients every day, aren't they? Because people are not necessarily understanding the difference. So that's that's a really important point to note that you, you know, maybe if you don't 
need it. It's um it's not going to get you to financial freedom faster by just taking a holiday, certainly, is it? <laughs> exactly right. Yeah. And look, I think that's why it's uh, important to stress uh, to everyone that get in contact with your consultant because they will have the expert advice and understand uh, what might be best suited for you. Mm. And 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 I'm hearing from you too that the you know don't panic if you can't get right through and and if things aren't looking good it, it the banks are still working on the details as well so it it will kind of flow through is is our view isn't it yeah absolutely okay. yes awesome so um if people have made an appointment or they're waiting to hear back from NZHL um and maybe they are in a challenging situation or not what what things can they can you do as a client to get ready for your meeting with us yeah sure so look again reiterating uh, don't panic if you get in touch with your nzhl consultant they will get back in touch with you um, and the first few things you could do is map up your map sorry map out your current financial position and what that might mean is uh, what your income looks like if you still have income coming in, what your expenses are, and importantly, how much cash you have on hand um, and how long you anticipate that might last you. If that's a week or a month, uh, that's important to know. So your current position. Um, and if you are, if your employment has been impacted or your income's been impacted, just any formal notifications you have from your employer, uh, have that ready to share with your consultant. Um, and of course, for those uh, who are self-employed, um, any financial information you have and if you have applied for any assistance um, already. And if you haven't, I would really recommend you check the Work and Income website for more details because uh, the government support package does also uh, support uh, people who own their own businesses and are self-employed. And there is a financial package there that you can apply for today. And that's for businesses as well with wage subsidies, isn't there? Because a lot of our clients are business owners as well. Absolutely. Yeah. Yes. So yeah. uh, with employees to check with their employers and have anything formal um, with respect to uh, their employment and their income. And yes, with anyone who owns their businesses, self-employed, uh, check with the work and income website uh, for those subsidies. Okay. And just, just a on the mortgage holiday, you noted that details are still coming through and they could they could come quite quickly, couldn't they? So just noting at the time of this video being produced, we don't have the details. So um, everything in the video still stands, but we may we may update or we, um, we'll see how we go. Well, I think lots of New Zealanders are saving money on buying flat whites at the moment anyway. So um, <laughs> I know you and I are, Chris, that's for sure. I'm, I'm having coffee at home, Lenska. <laughs> yeah, 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 good, good. So look, um, thank you. I think um, I'm sure everyone's found that really useful. Um, just so the people watching know, this is Chris and I's first attempt at this. So we hope we've um, we've hope we've got something for you. Um, to close out, um, please do. I know we've said it a lot, but do remember to check in with your local consultant and give them a bit of leeway to come back to you. Um, you can email us through our website if you need to as well. Um, and but. The people on the ground in the regions, our 80 wonderful business owners, they're there to help you. And um, you might you might also be interested to know that NZHL, one of our values, is actually excellent together. So we're trying hard to be that for our clients right now. Yeah, absolutely. And with COVID-19, we're all in this together. So please, everyone, stay home, stay well, reach out if you need any assistance. And kia kaha, everyone. Awesome.